want to start a cannabis company? Hey, are you doing a financing right now? Do you know if you did just five things, you have a chance to up your game? Now, for many years, both in the tech sector as well as cannabis, I have delivered this smarmy little set of five ideas that are game changers. So listen up, because this is what I call it five stupid things that entrepreneurs do over and over again. Now, let me tell you, I am a long-time investor, a venture capitalist with a fund, and now building a fund in the cannabis industry. So I have seen a thousand times a thousand companies. So I don't leave the investors out too. I do a little piece on the five stupid things that investors do, because if you're raising money, you need to know what those things are. So let's go. Here they are. First of all, about the stupidest thing that you can do, and unfortunately women do this all the time too, is you better know your numbers. That is so important. It's just amazing how that's critical. If you come to me and I ask you what your pre-money valuation was in the last round and you have a blank look on your face, guess what? You may have gotten this meeting, but you won't get the next one. I want you to know your numbers. I want you to be a good steward of our money. That is critical. Number two, spit it out, would you? So many entrepreneurs, and I'm sorry to say, women do this all the time, but men do too. You need to tell me what is your business and what's the business of the business. That's important. Number three, you worry about dilution instead of finance and runway. All worried, oh my golly, what, I'm giving up 25%? Are you kidding me? That's critical if you want our money. Next one, you better build the right team. You better not be afraid of having dynamic people around you who, guess what, might even be smarter than you are. That's important. And then lastly, you have to be able to create a great esprit de corps. I want you to say, follow me up the mountain not here's the mountain, critical. Those are five really important things, but now let me tell you the completely stupid things that investors do, that I have made every one of these mistakes, and I wanna make sure you understand them. First of all, we often way, way overpay for companies. That is not a good idea. So if you come to me with a great big valuation as an entrepreneur, you know, that's, that's important that I pay a right va valuation. Another critical thing, we tend to throw money at deals that we know nothing about. That's really silly because it's important to understand what we're investing in. Thirdly, and this is a nuance, it's important to really understand the profile of that CEO. Does she really know what she's doing? Does she know what to do and how to do it? And then also, how does she think Maybe I have a good idea, but does she embrace the same idea? That's critical. Next, what about draconian terms? We come up with these terrible terms for entrepreneurs. Not a good idea. So be aware of that. And I always say, if you let the wrong investor in, your life will be miserable. And lastly, we tend to keep throwing money at a company even when it's not scaling. So there's just some of the five things that investors do over and over again. Be aware of those things. Be aware of the completely silly things that entrepreneurs need to keep in mind, and then you've got a chance. Let me tell you what Women Grow means to me. Women Grow put me in the cannabis industry. The fabulous Jasmine Hupp convinced me that I would be on stage and do a little mini TEDx talk in the beautiful Denver Opera House. And I had a blast because I came out with my uh, coat dress on, I took it off on stage, I had my Wonder Woman outfit on, and the audience, all 1,400 fabulous people in the audience, screamed and yelled and laughed, and they stood at the end. It was my finest come out hour. I loved it. To this day, women come up to me and throw their arms around me and said, it's Wonder Woman. I am so proud of the long history I've had with Women Grow and the fabulous work that it has yet to do, of which I hope to support it along the way. Thank you so much.